someone wants to stay in Australia after doing this course from our Michael? Mm-hmm. What are the chances? What are the steps? I think PR is more based on the point systems and all that. But if I speak it like in general sense, in, in, the, in the sense like would you get a job or not? Yes. So that way, RMIT, I feel, is has a great outreach. Like few days back only, I met uh, the placement cell head of uh-huh. my department. That's good. That's through events, by the way. Should attend all the, all the events. All events. So I met her and she was telling me how she reaches out to companies and how all of that system works. So it's like they're working pretty hard for our placements. So it's yeah. like, yeah, you have to build that skill and you have to do all of that to reach there. It's like RMIT has opportunities. You have to take that. So it depends on that. Also, in SEM4, there is this uh, industrial project that we have. You can choose for a research project as well or industrial. So if you go for industrial project, that is the opportunity. You can build connections and uh, that's like an internship. So if you do really well in the internship, you can get a job directly from there as well. Oh. Yeah. So that's a good point. That is uh, like one of my friend has got that. And he's doing good in this. Yeah. Field. Oh, okay. So it's just you need to connect to the correct people. Yeah. yeah. That's it's what like I RMIT say. will give you an opportunity in semester four. Yeah. You need to take that. Write it down. After doing the job, Mm-hmm. The person will need to just follow up the basic rules as skill assessment and all, right? Yeah, yeah. You need to check whether your list. job mm-hmm. role comes under the skill assessment list. Then you can check whether you will be available for the future uh, steps to be a permanent resident in Australia.